but cut me some strips of um, <clears throat> out of scraps. You'll need some that are half inch wide, just under half inch wide, and then some that are just under a quarter inch wide to, to go between these gussets and I just ink them up a little bit on the edges. So I needed um, three more of the three more or four more of the half inch under half inch and four of the slightly under a quarter inch strips and they're the length just shy of the length of the album pages which is five inches so let me see here yeah they're just cut it about five inches wide long and you will glue these onto the gussets. Okay, I think that's good enough. So I'm going to flip back. This one doesn't need one because it's got the paper already there. So here's one here. So I think I'm going to do the stripe to kind of match the other page. Doesn't matter, they don't have to match, but that's just what I picked out that was in the scrap, so that worked out good. I'm going to put down some that I don't, haven't picked the papers out yet, so that's why I say it really, it really doesn't matter. You just want a little bit of color in between here. If you like it black, well, that's fine to just leave it that way. This is just something extra that you can that you can do if you like that look. Um, you might could use washi tape. I don't know, it might be a little bit wide and that might be a little hard to trim down, but you could try it. I would suggest that you add a bit of glue with it because sometimes it just will not stay stuck real well. So in a book where you're going to be turning pages, I would say that you would need to put some glue down for it. Now this is a quarter inch one. So this one I'm going to put stars on it. And you just need a little bit of glue down the center of this because it will spread out. I'll go ahead and fit that in there. You might need a little bit more glue. I need a little bit more glue here on the end. Because you do want to make sure it sticks. that and on the other side see I think I'm going to use a solid green and I did cut them down lengthwise just a little bit shorter than the five inch to leave a little black on each end yeah, I think this one's already done because we did that when we attached and I'm hoping that that is in a video I think so I'll double check but I did put this little um, charm holder piece from Tim Holtz that has a little ring and opened the brads and then uh, covered it with paper on the inside so this is made so that you can just grab this little ring and pull the book out of the the wagon so that one's already done open this one up so we have another quarter inch one and let's see, I like the stars. I think I'm going to use the stars. Again, I think I used it earlier on the other one. green. And these are real hard to cut with your trimmer unless you've got enough paper to um, 
measure the width of the paper, then scoot it over a quarter inch and just cut off a quarter inch off the edge of the paper. So I trim them down with my scissors sometimes. So they're not exactly perfect, but with those pages they work okay. And we need this one, which is going to be, I think I'll go with that pattern. I think I'll go with the green. I like the green. It has more ink on it. the last one back here on the back. I'm going to go with the pattern. Checking the time on my video. I don't want it to go too terribly long. These long videos take forever to upload with our wireless internet. So, okay, there we go. Now let's flip back. And I'm going to stop the camera and go ahead and cover my pages, my flip, the remaining set of flip pages, and then I will show you what I've done. Um, I don't think there's a need to keep the camera rolling while I do all that. Basically what you need to do is you need to measure. So most of them, measure yours to make sure I cut them like seven and a quarter long by four and three quarters wide and cover each page with paper, pattern paper of your choice. And I'm going to stop the video now and I'll be back later with showing you the covered pages and then start with some of the decorative things that I'm probably plan to do.